We want to uh, acknowledge our neighbors across the street, Noble Beast Brewing Company. Thank you guys. They honored Jimmy on their social media pages, throwing it back to when they opened and the time Jim welcomed them to the neighborhood with a plate of cookies. <laughs> we actually dug up the old video for you. Look at this. Welcome back, everybody. We have new neighbors here on Lakeside Avenue, right across the street from Channel 3. They are the Noble Beast Brewing Company. And because we are always neighborly here, we welcome them with some cookies. We're going to go over and say hello. We did this when the FBI moved in. I mean, we really did it when the FBI moved in. So we're going to do it now with the Noble Beast Brewing Company. Come on, we're going to welcome them. Oh! Hey, hey Jim. Hello, hello, hello. How are you? Sean? Yes. Welcome, nice to meet you. Sean. Oh, thank you. From your new Look neighbors at here Plus at Channel me. 3. Yeah. Look at those. Look at this. The Noble Beast Brewing Company. And it's shaped in the you know, nice beautiful. cold beer mug. <laughs> and I, I've Beast. got this for you. Oh, you know? boy, that's better than the cookies. So you learned well. Well, again, we're really happy to have you across the street. I mean, really happy to have you right. across the Thanks. street, Sean. Thanks very, very much. Best of Thank luck. Thank you. <laughs> All right, Jimmy, he's, he said, oh, that's better than cookies. All right. We want to let you know Noble Beast today paying tribute to Jimmy with this sign there in their windows. Rest in peace to the voice of the Browns. And Jimmy just talking about that in the, the previous video about hearing people refer to him in that way. Yeah, means something. Um, it, it does mean something. It means that he did not just really solid good work, but yeah. memorable work yeah. for everybody. Yeah, that's what I have been most impressed with since being here is how the fans just adored this man. They did. Um, you know, no matter where they were in the country, wherever there are Browns fans, you know yeah. that there were people that listened to him, that remembered him, that respected him and loved him. So that's been cool to see. Jimmy is known far beyond our Cleveland borders, but he is Absolutely. loved so deeply. Yeah. All right. And just so you know, tonight at 7, we are remembering Jimmy Donovan in detail. We're taking a look at his life and legacy in the city of Cleveland here, and we're joined by so many people who worked closely with him. It is an hour-long special. It begins at 7 p.m. tonight. We hope you'll be here with us.